cable networks reach all corners of the planet. Some of them are underground, but some of the most important ones are submarine cables. Submarine cables carry over 99% of the world's intercontinental traffic, allowing people to be connected wherever they are in the world. Take, for example, a large international social network with employees and customers based around the globe. It's vital that they can transmit data to each other instantly and securely, and on a reliable network. Let's take a closer look at how these cables are laid. First, the ocean bed is mapped to minimise the impact on the environment and avoid later disruptions. Then, the cables are loaded to the ship straight from the factory and are stored on huge reels. Signal repeaters and boosters are also loaded on board and these will be laid with the optical glass fibre to make sure that data is not lost as it travels along the submarine cable. A plough is used to bury the cable into the ocean bed. When both ends of the cable are connected to the data centres on land, traffic can start. No matter how precisely and cautiously the cable was laid, it may break sometimes, but luckily, cable repairing ships can deal with these breakages. Once the ship arrives over the break site, the ship picks up the broken cable using a hook once both ends are on board, the cable and the insulation are repaired and then relayed on the sea floor so the traffic is uninterrupted again. Vodafone is one of the world's largest investors in submarine cables and we are constantly adding to our portfolio to ensure maximum resilience and the most up-to-date technology. If you want to learn more about the behind-the-scenes life of Vodafone Carrier Services, please subscribe to our channel.